Welcome, guys. Welcome, guys. It's the Dragon Ball Z announcer here. And today on Fluid 114 channel, we have a very special episode of Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's play Yu-Gi-Oh! The Twins of the Roses. Last time on Dragon Ball Z. It was the 4th of July. And America achieved their independence. But before that, we jump back in time. In time. In time. In time to Let's Play. And Washington and yeah, 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 yeah. No, we had mercy on you. We let you in for free. Run us over easily. Now, Uzel, I am Mayori Kuratsuchi, aka Sight Demon Nick McMartin. You're a chariot, big bro? That's right. We're still in ancient Egyptian England, and we have chariots now. Don't you mean cavalry, big bro? Get my knights, get my crusaders out here now. Okay, big bro, I'll get your crusader from the Roman Empire. That doesn't even make sense, Okuba. Shut up, Okuba. Oh, and by the way, I'll guarantee your safe passes until you met with Yugi. From Henry Tudor. But seriously, I hope you guys all... This is... Last time on Dragon Ball Z. Henry Tudor, you guys cheated, okay? Like, do you have to stop what I'm telling? You guys didn't actually win, you know. If we wanted to send the entire armada, we could have sent the entire armada, and you wouldn't even have an independence. Quote, America was at the time. You guys were, I would say you're about the level of a horseman, okay? You want complete throwaway pawns? Henry Tudor gave a speech right about the truth and of the American the monarchy, Revolution the kings and, queens, and how England didn't and really even try to defeat the them. If we, if we would have sent the entire England army from the start, you guys would have been crushed like a orange crush soda, and you and I knew it. Stupid, how stupid we would have looked. Fully unexplored, so it could have been him out. Bitch, that's what you are, America. And we did, because at that time, in the end, it's, it's easy to say we made the right decision, and we did, because in, at that time, America was fully unexplored, so it could have been huge, it could have been tiny, but the point of any good monarchy is to defend your own kingdom first and take care of the trash second, and that's what you are, America, trash, you are a trash nation, and you have been ever since you left the monarchy, and that is all. King Henry Tudor out. Boo! Try speaking American. I don't oh, even understand what you're saying. That was the announcement from King Henry Tudor. <laughs> what will the response from the Americans be? Uh, this guy's a total poser in America. Find out next time when we hear from the, the uh, prestigious president of America, Bandit Keith. <laughs> All right. All righty, guys. <laughs> and uh, as you can tell, we're just, we're just having a little fun today. Like, yeah, as you know, it is July 4th. Happy July 4th. i uh, going to record as many episodes as I can here real quick because we got family plans. But, yeah, I just thought of this idea kind of off the fly. So we're just, let's just do it. Let's just do it. So um, long story short, we picked the beast deck. And the reason I picked this one is because I want to try to beat as many people as I can by default. Uh, like I said, I doubt I'll have time to get all of, all, uh, 10, or is it 11? Uh, you know, defeated. But we definitely want to go for Weevil first. <laughs> Prepare face my insect deck. <laughs> I am Cornholio. Uh, let me, while this loads up, let me double check the view for you guys. Can you guys see everything? Because this is the first video I've kind of gone back and forth on the, uh, looks good to me. Well, let me get a good look at the field here while I see. Let me move forward here. Yeah, I can, and it's not like, t well, it's a little tilted. The view's a little tilted, so sorry about that. Uh, first turn, we got Hunter Spider. We got Ancient One, too. First turn, pass. Don't use a power up, Weevil. Thank you. Also, don't use a man eater by first turn. I'll try to fix the tilt for you guys a little bit. It's still going to be slightly tilted, but yeah, I'm not going to worry too much about the cinematography. 
because the point is, like I said, I want to uh, get out as many of these episodes as we can. Uh, let's go with Hunter Spider, actually. Hunter Spider ought to be good enough. Uh, and actually, I'm going to turn on battles for... I'll only do battles for the first two battles of the, each duel, and after that, I'm going to abbreviate, because like I said, we do want to... We do want to get this done quick, but uh, yeah, yeah, I've been uh, doing these quite fast, so I could honestly use a drink break, so let me grab a drink real quick. All right. <laughs> but yeah, long story short, I uh, <laughs> this is going to be a fun one. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy, and yeah, don't take what I said too personally, you know what I mean? Obviously, I'm doing this for fun, so you can't a uh, string shot them. Wow, that was the most super effective string shot attack I've ever seen in my life. Ariados couldn't do that. Ariados couldn't backflip and pose, bruh. <laughs> All right. Looks like you have become the hunted since I have Hunter Spider. <laughs> All right, and yeah, our king, our uh, deck leader. I didn't really talk about him. King Tiger Wayne Koo is actually pretty good. Check this out. It has an effect of movement. If face up, this card can move two spaces at time of, regardless of terrain. So if you get two or three of these, honestly, this card's pretty solid. So yeah, if you ever start with the King Tiger Wanku, it's actually one of my favorite uh, deck leaders. And uh, believe it or not, because you know how you can do custom duels on here? Yeah, to get more copies of your own card. It's actually King Tiger Wanku is one of the most recommended uh, deck leaders to start with, just because of its own effect. Yeah, you just custom... The, the, the strategy for uh, speedrunning is copy itself. Hopefully you get, you know, two right away in the custom duels, but you know, no guarantees, but yeah, hopefully you get two right away in custom duels, and then, yeah, you just put them in your deck, good to go, you know. And then as soon as you rank up any other card, switch that card out with King Tiger Wingu. Yeah, pretty good card. Now, of course, we're not going to do that. We're just going to... Negated tag figures. Yeah, we're just gonna play normally. Really, I just want to get to Bandit Keep, you know. I'm not expecting to finish uh, the entire spellcaster, huh? Uh, we're gonna dump some cards here. Let's dump... Oh! We have Cybersaurus. Fusion Hawk! How about this? Now go! Metal Greymon! Uh, I think I will put him in defense, though. Just because a lot of Weevil's uh, bugs, as you guys know, are going to be pretty strong, especially Quagar. we got to watch out for Quagar, Hercules. Stay in attack mode, huh? You got the same attack points as me? That's a possibility. Ooh, this deck has Firewing Pegasus? Oh, yeah, it does. That's right. I remember seeing it. Because uh, uh, off-screen, obviously, I saved. and I took a brief look at the deck, but yeah, that's a pretty good one. Six stars? Pretty good. Pretty pretty good. Yeah. Uh, this has got to be a Hunter Spider, right? Yeah, yeah. Bigger. All right. Well, they're going to just take each other out. So I know I said I'd show the first two battles. Ah, screw it. I'll show it. And then after this, we will abbreviate the battles, guys. Sorry, but, you know, like I said, I'm trying to get as much done as possible. Now I activate the trap card, Clone. This allows me to clone your monster, Yugi. So now I have a gazelle as well. <laughs> you are weak, Yugi. My field is wide open and you couldn't even attack me. So why don't you try it? Ha! Well, at least I'm not adopted, Kaiba. What? That's right. Screw the rules. I'm in love with Nurse Joy. Ha! That's right. You don't know who your daddy is. That's right, Kaiba. After all these years, I'm your daddy. Say I'm adopted. Say it one more time. Find out what happens. Aw, <laughs> oh, your mommy must be very proud. Whoever that is, uh, that's it. I activate the effect of my card. I activate the effect of my card. I activate this, I activate this, I activate this. I activate your mother. What? That's right, Kaiba. Your mother. I activate her. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I'm terrible. Um, yeah, let's just try to outflank him. That's the speedrun strat. So I know these cards are weak, but you know, let's try, just try to outflank this guy. He's not even gonna scooch. What? He didn't play anything. Did you see that? Oh, maybe he doesn't have the summoning stars. Well, it sucks to be you. Uh, go Hanaiwa. Now this is in a. Okay, yeah. That's my cyber source. Unfortunately, I have my two weakest cards next to him, but you know. These are direct attacks, so I will take it. So you gotta move to the left now, buddy. Did your AI just glitch there for a turn? What was going on there, Weevil? 
Come on, bro. Scoot over. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Yeah, his AI was, like, glitched. Or he just, he didn't have the stars. Yeah, this is a five star. So, yeah, yeah, he, he was just skipping for the stars. But you still could have moved over, bro. I don't, I don't know what you're thinking on this one. Oh, right, right. Well, this is, I like Quake, uh, Hercules Beetle, so we'll show this one, too. That'll be the last one. Okay, Infinity the Scissors! Man, that is cool. That's gotta be at least a hundred slices there. That's an air cutter that's super effective right there. Very effective. But I, I like Hercules Beetle. He, he looks cool. Much cooler than Quake on. It's like Heracross, bro. Heracross! Alright. Abbreviation time. So, uh, reminder, abbreviate at the start of your turn, Josh. Okay, so, yep. And there we go. And I should be able to summon next turn, right. Uh, let's go with... Um, I guess I'll go with Sparks. Uh, I'll just play the uh, Life Restoring one, actually. Yeah, unfortunately he's going to take out Cybersaurus here, but... Yeah, not much we can do about that. Um, I could just stay here, actually. Let me think. Oh, if only... <gasps> might have the combo. Okay, so I move here. He can only direct attack me once. So the way he's going to direct attack me is right here. We can tank the 2,000. That honestly doesn't matter. Um, we do want to make sure, though, that he doesn't move here. Well, no, no. Even if he moves here with his deck leader and moves here, like, he can only attack me once. Okay. Go, go. Go, evil. I think we got this. I think we got this. Yeah, move up. Right, right. Yeah, attack me with that 950. And you wasted Man Eater Bug? Highly questionable decision. And that moves back. Okay. So that's not a problem. Another 13. Because I was expecting to take 2,000 there. But honestly, what you just did is not a problem at all. Because now, you see he has 2350 left. Boom. Firewing Pegasus. Torch his life points. Go! Meteor Dragon! Meteor Wing! Garudamon! Nice! And just like a Nightmare Troubadour, Firewing Pegasus! Maximilian Pegasus saves the day for us once again in the starter deck. Oh, the LPs are coming full circle, guys. If you're a long-term fan, you know what I'm talking about. All right, it doesn't matter what cards we win, but I guess I'll try for a negate attack. It's probably the best thing, but that's one, boom. Got it. Go for three in a row, that's one, boom. Missed it. Go for, I guess, Hunter Spider? Uh, missed it, but Pink Trap is good because it lets us have lower cost. But yeah, I'll probably throw in a negate attack for... Uh, something real quick. What time are we at? Ah, 13 minutes. Okay, we can keep going. We can keep going. Now I lost. Can't be having it. <laughs> All right. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, son. And now, oh, yeah. Don't you get banded Keith right away? Do you? I didn't even think about this, guys. <gasps> you do? Wow, so I can only get to him in two duels. Okay. Um, what time are we at here? 13 minutes? Um... Okay, guys, that's actually going to be the end of the first episode of actually dueling. In between episodes, I'll throw in the negate attack, and then we will hear the response from America. Bandit Keith. Yeah, Britain. I mean, in America. You're, you're going to hear from me, Henry Tudor, and I'll tell you why American is superior next time on Let's Play. Yu-Gi-Oh! Duelist of the Roses, 4th of July special in America. See you guys.